from what's going on. Messi and Ronaldo. Let's start off with Lionel Messi. Um, interesting news coming out of France. Today, just yeah, before yeah. we came on air, I think about two hours ago, he's been forced to render an apology to the <laughs> PSG institution and to his teammates. He basically... I don't know if anybody has the quotes here, but I, okay, I, I, you can fish out the quotes while I just go through the uh, sequence of events. So, what happened was that Messi is an ambassador for the Saudi state. Now, Saudi Arabia want to host the 2030 World Cup to be able to boost their tourism. They've looked at what their Qatari neighbors have done, mm-hmm. and they are saying that, you know what, this is a path we should also be going on because, I mean, we are richer than these people. So they've recruited Lionel Messi as an ambassador. Now, earlier in the season, they tried to get him to come and do ambassadorial work, mm-hmm. but his schedule would not allow him. Now, PSG lost 3-1 to Lorient, I believe, last week. Yeah. And then they had two days off. Messi sought permission from the club to go do this ambassadorial work, mm-hmm. and the club refused. Mm-hmm. Now, he decided that I am Lionel Messi. If I have <laughs> ambassadorial work to do, nobody can stop me. Jetted off with his family, not alone, his whole family, to go do his ambassadorial work. And PSG, apparently from reports from France, for the first time since the Qataris took over, have taken disciplinary action against Lionel Messi. They suspended him for two weeks. Now, the two weeks will result in a two month, a two million, um, two million euros salary for fishing for Lionel Messi. Two Charlie, people that my salary two weeks be two million euros. Now <laughs> <laughs> they go on. Lionel Messi will forfeit two million euros for the two weeks, and he has apologized as well. But the big picture is that Al Hilal is offering Messi. 320 million euros a year to come and play for them. That is, I think it is part of the grand scheme of marketing Saudi Arabia in the lead up to that World Cup. What's next for Lionel Messi? Let, let me start to you, Susu. I mean... Well, the apology is here. Yes. His, his so, apology. So, 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 read the quotes, read the quotes for me. Well, and then I'll, I'll, let, I'll let Nathan get into a bit of background before okay. I get So, Messi says, first of all, I want to apologize to my teammates and the mm-hmm. club. Honestly, I thought we were going to have a day off. After the game, like we did in previous weeks, I had this trip organized, which I had cancelled already. Mm-hmm. I could not cancel it again. I repeat, I want to say sorry for what I did. I'm waiting to hear what the club wants to do with me. As simple as that. Mm. Later. <sighs> wow. Um, <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's a very interesting story. If, if, if you understand French football and you understand French culture and you, you understand how French fans especially PSG fans have perceived their club in the last few years. This is not too surprising. French fans can be very demanding at times. Marseille, you can ask Patrice Evra. Yeah, Marseille, Marseille, Marseille. <laughs> <laughs> Guys who've played for Olympic de Marseille will tell you that French fans can be very, very difficult. Mm. Now, PSG fans have been on their club for a while. They've been on the necks of the people running the club because they say, look, you're spending all this money. Mm-hmm. And there's, the main objectives for spending the money have not been met those objectives, winning the Champions League and, and doing big things in Europe, those things haven't happened. Mm-hmm. A few weeks ago, it was Neymar yeah. who got attacked, quote-unquote, by fans. They went to his house, held all kinds of abuse at him. In the last few weeks, PSG have been struggling on the field. They've not been winning games and all. Mm-hmm. And then the Lorient episode kind of ticked the fans over. And then they went after Lionel Messi, went to his place, we're singing very unprintable things I cannot repeat here <laughs> in Spanish to him. And, you know, then you had this trip and all. Their context, a lot of people sometimes forget, is that after France lost the World Cup final to Argentina, they were very upset by how the Argentines celebrated, especially with Emmy Martinez yeah. and how he mocked Kylian Mbappé. So they took they took offense. Is it that deep? They took offense. I mean, yeah. I would say hanging like a kind of doll of him and pretending to kill it and putting a coffin. Yeah. Didn't do much. Yeah, well, was, and I'm sure they were expecting Messi to try and yeah. They were expecting Messi to try and comment about Messi that or at least dramatic. Yeah. So I think Messi, maybe Messi's silence also made them. No, but what was he supposed to do? do? You know. So so that really upset a lot of French fans. Mm. And so there's a mix of a lot of there's that emotion following the, his trip to Saudi. They moved to the PSG HQ. They, they went to yeah. the PSG to HQ go to protest. go and protest. And those protests, I've seen. Um, they have called him a mercenary. I've seen some of the banners. Um, 
there was one that what, I remember. What are the things that say? Yeah. The, the one that I, the picture was, uh, they say what, uh, direction, demission. Mm -hmm. It's actually telling the board to resign. So demission, resign, there's resignation, whatever. Yeah. So they are telling the board to resign because they've spent money. Now they accuse the board of not having a plan, signing players anyhow, and signing mercenaries. Mm. So they've classified Neymar and Messi, those two. <laughs> As mercenaries, because people who only want to who come only for the money and come the good and play times. for the money and the good times. So really, that is where the situation is. Messi has apologized. I don't know what it means personally. If you ask me, I think PSG's decision to suspend him was a sa face-saving tactic to make it look like the player had gone against the club rules. Because the context is this: Messi, the club had they gave the players two days off, mm -hmm. and then Gaultier calls a training session on Monday, which was not planned for. Mm -hmm. Messi was already on his way to Saudi. He had postponed the trip a couple of times. So once that two-day window opened, he decided to go and do all of that. But it's a very difficult time at PSG. Let me just ask this. Do you think that Messi is acting like this because he does not see... He's not staying. He does not see a future with himself no, 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 at PSG. He's not staying. No, no, no. He's leaving. And you think no. that that's why he thinks, you know what, I can, I can go on my... My, I, my, my ambassador... I, you you have taken two million. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so there are obligations he has to meet commercially. So he has yeah. to do it. I think that, that that marriage is coming to an end and he will leave in the off-season. Um, on a free? On a free. Yeah. He opted against signing that extension. Yeah. His father, Jorge, told PSG we are not signing, so he will leave. Where he's going, I can't tell. A few years ago, in time Miami, David Beckham's team showed interest. Yeah. But in the last few days, we've heard rumors of... Um, Al Hilal. Al Hilal. That money is Throwing juicy, absolutely baloney money. 20 million euros. A, line on Messi. a year. Ah, I, I, I don't know. Course, but really, that's, that's the context. And, and, and right just now, a final thing. My parents for not letting me. We'll see you. Just, <laughs> just, a final thing. just a final thing about, about PSG as a club. Yeah. PSG as a club internally have decided to go in a new direction. They want mm. to focus a bit more on young players because in the last few years, they've realized that they've lost some good talent. Um, Coman, Kinsley mm -hmm. Coman, mm -hmm. he left. Musa Diaby. Musa Diaby is left. Um, um, yeah. Kolomwani is yeah. left. A few others. They look at those players. If you look at the Paris area, the talent in that, that area, talent that, in that they are and they letting go to yeah, play and, everywhere. And they feel that these are players we could have had in our team. When they were spending yes, time because, looking because, elsewhere. Yeah, because now the, the squad is top heavy. You have all these, ace, like some of the A-listers are in the starting team. Yeah. But on the bench, Gauti has nothing. Mm -hmm. He has 17 and 16-year-old boys. He's throwing into games. The players are trying to understand themselves and it's not working. And PSG say, oh, you know what? We are going to go in a new direction. We want to focus on the young players and actually build this project the right way, it turns out. <laughs> so PSG will experience some turmoil and they need to understand. And I think the fans, I think the fans have been, when you look at this new direction, ultimately they'll be happy. But it annoys them that they have the likes of Neymar, Mbappe and, and Messi. And they are not blowing teams away in France. They are not winning in Europe. So they don't quite understand where all like, what's going on here. Ben, let me start with this point. I think sometimes it's the hope that kills you. Hmm. And I tend to understand every PSG fan doing what they are doing now. You mean the hope well, of the, winning the Champions League? The hope, the hope of having, having to see all this talent. The, yes, yes. Yeah, you see, final... if you're a football fan yeah. and you see, you saw what Messi did at the World Cup, yeah. you saw what Mbappe did at the World Cup, yeah. you saw what Neymar did for Brazil, and then they come together, and then that and they, same, and they are, they are that same team. Fighting with the three this. of them in the same team mm -hmm. was never going to work. You see, to PSG fans and, and, will tell you, and I have a lot of PSG. Mm -hmm. Shout out to my very good friend, John Boafo. Nice one. He yes. says he's in Cote d'Ivoire, actually. He loves PSG. La Cote d'Ivoire. Yeah. He, he was his school in Paris. <laughs> when you watch PSG play, it's as though they start with, they play 7v10. Yeah. Because Messi, Neymar, the Mbappe, they, do, they don't do anything without the ball. So to start, it doesn't matter who you play against. Mm -hmm. A seven v ten in every situation. You always struggle. To get some you always struggle. And yeah. you see, these days uh, in France, the teams have gradually grown not to fear PSG anymore. Okay. They don't fear PSG anymore. So once that fear factor is gone, gone. teams now come to the park the points. They enjoy themselves. This is the first time they've considered three goals at home since the Qataris took over. Mm -hmm. yeah. That, that and, says and a lot. L'Oreal. Yeah. And not the team that exactly. L'Oreal are typically See, a relegation threatened to mid level. For me, team. I think that I support what the fans are doing 100. percent It may look like they are going overboard, but I support them. Oh, See, maybe they don't support them, but they are right. Mm. Oh, the fans. <laughs> See, <laughs> their actions, what, behavior is not what, right. Land on your what, what are you a football fan yeah. and look at those talents in your team? And for the French league, they always win the French league. For the French cup, they struggle. They struggle nowadays. Sometimes they are the out. See, they've, they've not been dominant. Lille have so, won. 
they've had it's like now they're winning every other year yes the fans will always not understand why these talents are not because see time is going and very soon this place will retire Neymar especially and, and all, Neymar is always injured one two is injured one two yeah. is injured Messi uh, can, plays as if he's not even they, they involved they, in the game him, see man. When you watch Messi play for PSG mm-hmm. and you watch Messi play for Argentina, yeah. there's a huge gap. No, then like... What were they expecting? Hmm. That the young man will leave Barcelona and come and exert himself at that age? It is the is coaches it... who don't have the balls to balance the team, team. to bring the best out of him. Mm. Ha- the but truth is, they were never going to Argentina, get anywhere without every three other of them player but pitch. him. Every other player mm-hmm. is working hard. It's working hard for him. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We didn't see him. He decides whether to chase the opponent yeah. at the World Cup. Do you know Messi? But the like of the Enzo most... Fernandez, uh, uh, McAllister, DePaul, McKinney. Hard workers. Uh, hard workers. And, and let's even go back to his last season at Barca. If you watch them well, mm-hmm. Messi was even pressing. He yes. walk all oh, the time. He, he was walking. And How often do you see players walk? I'm using the word walk. Oh, no, yes, walk. He was strolling no. on the football pitch. Yeah. There's strolling. this clip of William Guardiola mm-hmm. that he said that when you see him walking like that, He's not just walking. He's actually <laughs> looking at the loopholes <laughs> in the opening. So he, that is where he tends to walk towards or he drifts towards. Yeah. And the players are supposed to locate him. He said he started walking long ago, even under him, Pep. Yeah, there yeah, were yeah. times where he, he won't he press. There's, there's, walk. A, there's a very popular, and, and, there's and a very popular story see, mm-hmm. in Spain. With, when, but when, all this, when, do the fans of PSG understand what he does on the pitch? They don't understand. You don't need to understand. To understand. So, the point for is, them, they just want him to win. win, win. And the problem is, if you're if you're a football fan, oh yes, we have Messi, we have Mbappe, we have Neymar. We should win. We basically have three of the best ten players in the world. Why are we not winning? That's as simple as that. It comes down to the coaching. Look, the coaches they bought. Or those coaches that I, I think they've created do they have and, the boss to let's say look good. I start to Messi and Neymar good. or Messi and I, I, I think PSG, PSG, I think, I think PSG no, no, no. have yeah. nurtured a bad culture with there, this that, star player that's no that's the, that. truth is, okay. the truth is if they wanted to win anything you mm-hmm. have to play you can only play two of them at the same time it's as simple as that watch any top team mm-hmm. there's not more than one player who gets away with not pressing at most two at most now you have three players not pressing. It means that the whole defense of the other team is free to progress their ball. Yeah. Mm. You can't you can't win so, any so, serious. So then the ultimate like blame goes to the club for, oh, yeah, for, for not getting a proper coach to balance the team. Let me just stay with you, Susu. Where does Messi go next? Where do you see him realistically land? Because we are all agreeing that these are signs of I don't want to stay at PSG at the end of the season. Oh, 100 percent Barcelona. <laughs> Barcelona. Barcelona will be a completely wrong move. They are trying oh, to no move. move. They are trying to move. move. They are trying ah, to move. Be How is that a wrong move? We are not talking oh. about how, financially. But so now we they, say they, they want they to win the they Champions League they again. They don't have the the regal room Look. to sign him. They are no, trying no, to get no, no, out of the league. We are talking about I've reduced my salary. I'm coming. I'm not talking about sentimental anguish. I'm talking about if you are saying that Barca, we we are doing all of these things so that we can win the Champions League again. Buy Messi will be a step back. In terms of that, we want to. Oh, be please! Defense. I disagree with the. I, 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 I no, if you disagree. ask me, I think Messi is in Let decline. A lot of people are. Listen, see, decline. ask me. It's, if you ask that. me, if you ask me, there are two levels, and Susu mentioned one, mm-hmm. and I'm sure to see your point is based on output, data, numbers, whatever. I feel mm-hmm. that that decision is seventy percent fueled by sheer emotion and sentiment. Mm. From, the Barca, 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 from the Barca side, from the Messi side, not from us. the Messi, I'm not. I'm not Messi. He's he he's open to options. Mm. I think Barca are making that decision because of pure sentiment. Because when you look at how the relationship ended the first time, mm-hmm. they yeah. want to bring it back. And all the elements are in place for that. There's Chabi Hernandez. And there's why, will he, why will he not romanticize and there's a lot, the Messi there's return? There's a lot of turmoil at Barca now. A Messi return will suit and all I'm the good. And that's the right political. And my thing is, if mm-hmm. you look at Barca's squad as constructed, okay. they still need some work to be a Champions League contender. You bring Messi in mm-hmm. with all the resources you are going to have to put to that. It means that the it's, other it's, parts of the squad that you need to upgrade at this point in time, in the short term, we'll if you say you want to be a contender, Messi is right coming now. as a free agent. He comes as a free agent. <laughs> he can decide that I'm coming home. Slash, look, slash down my salary to a certain amount. I, unless, and this Messi, you can't tell but, me that. But, but, if, but, if, but he already showed the first time that he was not willing to do He that. was not asked to do that. No, no. Yeah, he was not asked. He was not. He said, he said the club asked never asked him to him do that. To do that. Mm. If I look at the, the manner in which the club had been blowing money around, those in charge did not have the moral right yeah. to ask me to reduce my salary. Yeah. But you see, no one asked him. The so first then, time. therefore, look, you can't tell me that Messi don't have what it takes. Yeah. 
Hold on. Influence big games. No. Let me understand. What you say? He said he's a wrong move. You are cutting him. You are not letting me finish. Messi going back to Bassas are wrong. Can everybody hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on? Can everybody be entitled to their own opinion here? Thank you. Finish your point. I'm not saying that Messi is a quality player or anything like that, but I'm saying that if he's going to take the wages he is taking, that we expect him to take, you didn't say that first. No, but that's the assumption. We are already said that he's going back to Barca. Was around. He's not going to come and take minimum. Go and come and take one thousand. He's not going to do it. He can't. He's, he's not, not going to, he's not going to do it. I, I, see, I don't think that's going to happen. He's not going Listen, to happen. Messi has always, always availed himself. You see, you see. Unless, you are, unless we are working on the assumption, which I as I'm thinking is wrong, that Messi is going to come and collect 1,000 so, 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 so euros a week or La Liga minimum wage. Mm -hmm. Because if we assume he's going to collect market wages, mm -hmm. which is what he can get at other clubs, yeah. and come and play for Barca, they can't even afford him as he stands. Mm -hmm. So they will have to maneuver financially they, to that, bring that's, him that's in. What they are trying to do which now. is what is being reported they are doing. Yep. Mm -hmm. This is their they assumption. They are moving things out of the way is, to be able to it. get him. So if they are going to have to make those financial sacrifices, mm -hmm. it means that they are not going to be able to upgrade their squad where they need to yes, to win not, see, the championship. Okay, that's the whole point. You, let me can tell I go you. now? Okay, let me okay tell you coach. Go. Go. How? <laughs> they can also raise proper money mm -hmm. by the presence of Lina Messi. Uh -huh. They can raise proper money. Proper, proper money. Proper for market the merchandise. Well. They can raise proper money to use it to go and buy players. Mm. If you look at this Barcelona team, tactically, yeah. how many players do they really need? They still, I, th I think they, they still, still need a right need, back. They still need... <coughs> they don't have a they credible they right still, back. Well, you, Who's scared to fine, they, 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 they still need to replace Busquets. replacement already. already. Frankie de Jong. You can talk about Frankie de Jong already. Frankie slots into the... They are taking Gundahan for free. Yeah. Messi for free. You tell me, Barca is so broke that they can't afford salary to... cap. Salary oh, no cap. More. Salary cap. Salary cap. Is it salary cap? It's about how much See. people will take. What I'm saying is, look, if Barca, mm -hmm. as big a merchandise they are or a club they are, yeah. if they want to bring Messi, they'll bring Messi. I want to look at the footballing reason. What is going to happen I, on the pitch? I, I'm telling you that Messi I'm is saying, in decline. No, and no, he's, but he's not at a this player age, no, 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 at this age, age I'm at coming. Age. At this okay. age, yeah. he's red. He will decline. Mm -hmm. But he's twenty times better than so many players who are in their peak. Mm. Hundred times. And I don't disagree with that. That is the I point. I don't disagree so with that. So if the system is set up for him to bring the best, ah, no more. Eba JJ man. You still, my problem is problem is why, 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 why are you still designing you a system around a 37 year old? Ah, it's the best ever. 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 It's the best we have seen since the days of Maradona, since the days of Ronaldo, Ronaldo the original. It's okay. Since the it's days of that. It's the best we have seen. I want to say something to add to what Coach is saying. If we are talking in a vacuum that we know that Barca can spend money and still upgrade their squad. I would not have a problem with it. But the way I see it, mm -hmm. I don't think they'll be able to do both. That is why I'm saying that I'm mm. against it. Fair, fair, fair point. A quick one. I, I, I think I when Messi left, there was one thing he said, which convinces me that he can always come back to Barca. That statement of he was never asked to slash his yes, salary. Nobody asked him. Makes me but maybe realize that. Pretty. <laughs> it's not really about the money for him. Uh -huh. When it comes to Barcelona now, uh -huh. it's not about money. It's about homecoming. That's it. Okay, it's about so homecoming for Messi family, now. Guys, see, his family, his wife, the children are all saying so, so wait, Barcelona, so Barcelona, Barcelona, Barcelona. So, and so, for the simple so reason, saying, who else to use Messi if not for Javi Hernandez? That I completely understand. Who and else? I, all I'm I can saying, use Messi than Javi now. I get your point. Mm. I tend to agree more with Susu in the sense that Barcelona have a decision to make. And it's kind of a bit of, a, a bit of the quandary Man United found themselves in when they had to make the Ronaldo <laughs> call, <laughs> right? Because here you are mm. where you've got money and you have a choice. Okay, we upgrade the squad or we bring back Ronaldo because everybody loves Ronaldo, whatever, whatever. I feel that Barca need to be extremely careful with that decision. And a very bad coach at the time. Mm. Granted. All contributed. <laughs> see, so I feel that Barca need to think through this very carefully. Because, you see, at, at various levels, yeah. okay, even if you bring Lionel Messi in, mm -hmm. can he give you... 30 uh, goals. No, I'm saying, can he play throughout oh, the season? Level Hold those. If you are bringing him in yeah. for the purpose of winning the Champions League, that I can completely understand because the Champions mm -hmm. League shows up twice every month, probably. Yeah. So you 18 can... 13 games. 13 games across 
two two calendar years overlapping. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, nine months. Nine months. So you can bring him in you and you get a job done. You don't play no, 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 no. That's what I'm saying. So, so a yeah, maximum of 25. Fine. Nice whatever. one. Whatever. But Barca, and that's why I agree with you. So Barca needs to think through this carefully because that decision yeah. will not come cheap. Already, don't. See, now, hold on. Already, they signed, I think they signed Pedri to a, Pedri or uh, They Gavi can't even sign Gavi. To a new contract. They can't they, sign they Gavi. Have, they Listen, have to rescind. There's the option of selling players. They have to rescind. See, the there's the option of selling players. No, no. You guys are forgetting that. Barca can sign players and get messy. You see, they're sending the team. They're sending players you're talking about. It's a problem because Barca pays some of the highest wages. So players don't want to leave. Right now, it's already started. They are saying that they want Frank Kessi and some other. They don't want to leave. Because their wages are so high. They won't get anywhere. The same complaint. Barca cannot register some players. Barca they cannot, all got they registered. They all got registered. They were playing. They'll find a way See, out. They, 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 together, they sold future TV rights. They sold... They, 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 they are never... They, 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 they sold their kidneys. They sold their soul. Is there a sustainable way to run a club? Is there a sustainable way to run a club? For me, I think that at the moment, when Messi left, the soul of the team got missing. Bon you, you clearly see that there was we'll, something we'll, missing in we'll, Barcelona. We'll hear it, uh. Let, you will retire, but we'll retire I think that at Barcelona. coming home and retiring will be the greatest thing to do for his From career. No sporting director. You, you know yeah. what? So he has to come back see, home. You see, that's what I'm saying. This, all these it's emotional not, arguments. It's not emotional. 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 How is it emotional? They got you So You are thinking of... Hold on. you say things. You think it's not emotional. When people are telling... Is it emotional coming home? Yes, can you get better? I can bash you. What guy is emotional? What is emotional about this? This is Chris. Chris. Can you get better? Me, I, me, I, 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 to accommodate an aging and declining Lionel Messi. Who is he? No, no, he's, he's coming. Yo. He's coming. They're not buying him. Salary that he will take. Yeah, finish. we hear you. As no. long as he's come to take a very low salary. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Listen, but if he's come to take the PSG salary, he's no, 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 no. Oh, Let's but, talk but, about. Let's okay, talk I said, about who else can use Messi than Barca? Barca made Messi, and they know how to get the best from him. We, 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 Nobody is doubting when he but comes. You see, the point take off the pressure of exactly. Gavi, whatever. His presence, hey, when his presence, he must not be there. Money will come. I am making it sound so small. You see, I side with, I side with the Susu party. On this particular move, I'm saying that you see, going to get Lionel Messi in itself it's, it's a sexy idea. It's, it's a nice idea. You shouldn't have left Look, in the first place. Yeah, the point I am making is this: it is not a cut and dry situation. It will cost and them. Need to it will cost them their liver, their lungs, their kidneys. Oh, they have to get out of the house. They have to get out of the house. They have to get out of the house. They have to collect anything less than 300, 400 thousand. They can afford it. How much is? Let's let's let's. I I think time I think time will have answers for all of us. 